Groups is a new feature allowing you to create a group and invite teachers, students and parents to the group with a code in a similar way to inviting them to join a class. Select Groups from the bottom left in Shobi and to create a group tap on the tool icon. Also note that to join a group you would select the second option here and enter the code you've been given to join a group. We'll create a group for now and we'll just call it test group and as before you'll see that Shobi has generated a code for us that's what we'll share with people. Also note that we can give the group a description to tell the people that are joining it what it's about and you should also see that there are some settings here for announcements only and where the parents and where the students can join. So if we were to switch these off this would be a teacher only group. Once you've tapped on save your group is created. and We need to have a little look at the uh, settings for this. With groups there is no shared folder and separate list of student names. There is simply this shared area on the right where content, interactions, text, audio etc can be shared by all members of the group. This is great for collaborative work, group feedback, brainstorming, shared ideas, sharing of documents and so on. As the owner of the group, and you can have multiple owners, you can change the settings of the group in several ways. If I do the tap and swipe to the left on the group name, as we've done before with classes and assignments, if we archive a group, this stops it operating. And this allows you to control when a group is operational. You can switch it on and off basically. So I'll archive this group and we can't see it anymore. To view your archive groups, switch this on here. You'll see that our test group is here and we can unarchive it and it becomes operational again. Alternatively, if you go into the group settings here on the top right and select group settings, you'll see that we can switch it to announcements only. This creates a situation where only owners can add content and the rest of the group can only view it. You should also note, if we go back to the uh, menu here for the group, that we can change the notification preferences. And this means that you can uh, change the situation uh, in terms of whether you have emails and push notifications when the group is active.